Hey guys, it's Macklin here. Today I'm reviewing a UNSC Trooper 2 pack. And as you can see here, you get a radio trooper and then just a normal trooper. And you get two back, well, radio backpack and a normal backpack with a magnum and a shotgun. And as you can see on the back, it shows all the season three two packs, um, up, warthog upgrades, I believe that's what they're called, and then all the single figures. And I will, and I'll open it, and I'll show you what it can do. Okay, I've got the first trooper, and this is the radio trooper. So as you can see, it's got great detail. The bag, I love the antenna. It's so wobbly. <laughs> no, I'll stop that. And it's also got a magnum, and he holds it pretty good. Like Svans, it kind of takes some time to put it in, but this guy holds it good. Now, the main issue with both of these figures, any UNSC troopers, even the ODSTs I think, like the new ones, they can't gra go over and grab the weapon, like like you could do with DMRs and assault rifles and shotguns, but with this, you can't, look, see, see, you can't, you can't get it, it's just, it's just ridiculous, it's really bad, but besides that, it's, it's a pretty cool figure. And this is the radio one, just so everyone knows. I believe I said that before, but anyway. And it's got some great detailing. And it's got two butt pegs. At least I think they're for the grenades. It's got a peg here. Well, uh, yeah, peg hole. Peg hole. And this has got a peg hole here. And it just goes in. Well, I'll show you the bag up close. It's got some pretty good detail. That's the radio. And that's like a switch thing, I believe. And this, this thing here, I'm not so sure. Either way. And he's got a good chest. And as you can see, he's got one of these on here, but the other one he doesn't. So, yeah. And I'll show you the next one. Now. Okay, guys, here's the second one. It, this is called... Oh, dropped the shotgun. Either way, I don't care. He... This one's called a medic trooper, and the different there's heaps of different things on here, such as the helmet, like it doesn't have the binoculars. It's got the armor piece here, as you can see, not like the other one. And and this one has the um, same one as the last one, so both of them are different. Just to let you know, and it's got a different bag, like this one's like. More marine-ish. <laughs> marine -ish, that sounds weird. But anyway. Go back in. Okay, it's gone in. And um, he has this bag. Whoops. <laughs> it came out completely. He has this bag. I believe it's a medical bag. Or a... Maybe a grenade bag or something. But it's a medical trooper, so it has to be a medical bag. And the chest is different, as you can see here. The chest is... um completely different actually and um, the knees I think are a little bit different or no I don't think they are actually and yeah he's got some good detail now with the shotgun it's a great weapon I love the shotgun it's my actually my favorite weapon on Halo Reach but action figures it's my it's like the one I really hate like look well, it's because of this guy's joints as well, but look, see, if I put it like this-ish, I don't know, but that's pretty much all the things he can do with a shotgun. Like, he can't put it over, grab it, all, that's all he can do. So, now I'll, I'll show both of them together. And, as you can see, this guy looks so much repaired. He's so repaired, not like this guy. And they have the same color, and sorry, I'll move the shotgun. They have the same pieces, and um, this one's got the binoculars. This one doesn't, as I said. And the feet are the same. And now I'll show you the size comparisons with the elite. I'll just move this guy because I don't want to hold both of them. Now, the, oh, <laughs> as you can see, this guy could just, like, 
if I had an energy sword, he could just, like, kill this guy. Like, look, he could eat his head off. That's how good this guy is. He's like, scrawny wimp. And he just faints. And then this guy. Okay, guys, thank you for watching this review. And I'll see you next time on YouTube.